Hello everyone, this is my 900 subscribers Q&A. Thank you everyone for subscribing and getting to this milestone of 900 subscribers, only 100 subscribers away from 1k. Without further ado, let's get straight into the questioning. The first question is, are you considering doing things other than cubing? Now, basically all my subscribers, they came from cubing videos and that's my audience. So I can't really change it up or do any other videos because that's what the people subscribe for. If I tried something else, I would definitely lose subscribers. So my main theme is always going to be cubing. So yeah. The next question is, will you keep uploading only shorts or normal videos as well? Now, shorts have gotten me all these subscribers. They do really well. They get a ton of views and they're basically my only way of getting a ton of views. Although a lot of my full videos have gotten many, many views. Now, to basically answer the question, after I hit 1K, I'm probably gonna start doing more longer videos as I have a bigger audience and I'll get more views, hopefully. So yeah, to answer your question, after I get 1K, I'll be uploading a lot more longer videos. And yeah. How many seconds do you average on 4x4 is the next question. And I don't really practice 4x4. I haven't solved one in a while now. But when I do solve them, I think it's around like 2 minutes, 1 minute 50, I don't know, something like that. But once again, I do not practice it, so I don't really have an exact number. The next question is, what is your main cube? So my main 3x3 is the RS3M 2020. As you can see, I'm using it right now in these solves. And um, it's a pretty solid cube. I got it over a year ago. But the thing is, it's super dry now because I never looped it before. So yeah, my main 2x2 cube is like the Chi Kri 2x2, something like that. Um, it's just a standard 2x2, two two. it's not that good, but it still gets me good times, so yeah. I don't really understand this question, um, secret talents, probably like soccer is probably like my talent. I'm pretty good at it, and I recently actually went to a final, but we kind of lost it, and yeah. The other question, I'm definitely not going to be doing that, I answered that one before, only cubing on this channel. Maybe a little magic, but that's pretty much it. My favorite 3x3 is probably the RS3M for its good price and great performance. Um, my PB in 3x3 is 12.07. I haven't broken it since in a while because I kind of stopped cubing for a little bit. I already answered which one is my main cube. And my favorite YouTuber is kind of complicated. I don't really have a favorite YouTuber. I watch a ton of them. If I had to like pick only one, I don't know, something like some D, Mr. Beast. I don't know. The next question is, how old are you? And I am old right now. This next question is, how did I get into cubing? So basically, when I was I was in a new school and everything, and there was just a table of kids, like with Rubik's cubes, all kinds, pyraminks, two by twos, three by threes, and they were all solving it. And I thought that was like super cool. So I went over there and I was like, can I try these cubes out? And it was super fun to me and I was like, I want to do this, I'm going to get fast at it, and I went on the grind, and here we are today. Alright, this is the last and final question. So, the sport that I like the best is soccer, obviously, and the team I support is Liverpool. Um, I've always supported them, and they're just my favorite team. Hopefully, we can win the Prem this season. And what video games I play, it's Minecraft, Clash Royale, and FIFA mostly, so yeah. Anyways guys, that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching and a special thanks to those who commented. We hit 900 subscribers and this is a huge milestone. Hopefully we'll hit 1k very very soon. So yeah, see you guys later. Bye.